Hi everyone. Uh, today we will talk about how you can create multiple business cards along with the QR codes using the data merge feature on InDesign. So on InDesign, uh, first of all, what we do is we will just create a new document. And uh, once we create the new document, uh, so we have to create a rectangle in like a, a business card rectangle. And it depends like how much dimension you want to keep for that particular rectangle. And within that rectangle, uh, we will specify fields for uh, the first name, last name, and the job description, the telephone number. And so it based on your requirements, like how uh, how many fields you want. And along with that, we will keep a place for the QR code as well. So I'll just zoom zoom in a bit so that uh, it will be clear uh, to, to see like how exactly uh, it's gonna take the data. Now, I have the data already uh, in place in, in a form of CSV format and this CSV format is comma delimited. So make sure whenever you try to save the file, it should be comma delimited and it has first name, last name, phone number and the QR. So this is the format uh, that we will use uh, for creating the Q card. So it starts with begin, uh, then V card and wherever you see slash n, it means uh, there is a new line and the version is 4.0. FN means the first name and last name, uh, telephone number, email address and uh, at the end we will just close close this business card so this is the format and you can you can uh, import like multiple uh, user details in this particular format so i have everything in place like for all the users so i'll just uh, go ahead and import that data source onto indesign so i go to windows and utilities and open the data merge dialog and i have to you choose the data source now uh, this is the data source, the QR uh, CSV, and you can see like all those fields are already there. So I select the first uh, rectangle and I want first name and the last name. So I chose these two uh, fields and now I choose the second uh, rectangle and I need the job title. The third one needs to be uh, the phone number. So I selected this and I choose the phone number and the last one is for the QR. So I select this and I uh, just click on the uh, QR field in the data merge uh, thing. So it will fetch all the information from the CSV file which I have imported in that particular uh, the data merge feature. And if in case I wanted to change uh, the format or uh, the fonts for the text what I would like in those fields so I can always go to the properties panel and I can choose like which font I need for that. So for the first name and the last name I need uh, Runam font and uh, for the phone number and and for uh, the job description I need uh, a different font and with, with a different uh, size of the font so accordingly I'll, I'll choose from here and you have to make sure that you keep uh, these uh, small fields like rectangles uh, big enough so that it will uh, like every uh, like if there is a very big name or big job title it will be able to like uh, you will get everything inside that particular rectangle. So now if I click on preview, you can see how it will look like. So this is the first, second, third, and fourth, fifth, and accordingly, this is how uh, it will look like when we try to uh, print or when we try to export it as a uh, as a document. So now if I go to create merge document, I can choose like whether I want a single or multiple records. So multiple records as in like there will be multiple uh, business cards on the same uh, page otherwise it will be a single page business card so this is how it will look if i create a merge document now uh, the same way i can i can create pdf as well like i can export it to pdf and accordingly i can get a pdf as well and now if you like have any edits or anything you can always edit the csv file and after that update the data source and it will work so hope uh, it helps in understanding how you can create QR codes and the business cards on InDesign. Thank you.